again, it's Tiffany coming to you again on behalf of ConceiveEasy.com. And right now we're going to talk about how to get this show on the road and get pregnant fast. There are a handful of tips I can share with you, um, but it is important to know if you really want a family, um, it's going to happen for you in its own time and at the right time. But there are things you can do to try to make that happen a little bit faster. The first and most important thing, and I say it in almost every video that I do, is to know when you're ovulating. Take the time to chart your cycle and know when you're ovulating. Again, if there's not an egg there to meet, the, if there's not a sperm to meet the egg when you ovulate, you just ain't gonna get pregnant. That's just how it goes. Um, so that's very, very key. Um, the second thing is to know that sperm can survive in your body for a few days. So if you are just getting started and you're, you're charting your cycle but you don't have it nailed down yet, you don't know exactly when you ovulate, a good rule of thumb is to have sex every other day. Why every other day? Well, because first of all, having sex every day, <laughs> that's not as much fun as it sounds. You will be worn out and not very happy by the end of the month. <laughs> um, and Second, so having it every other day does ensure that there's probably still some sperm in your body every day waiting to meet that egg when you do ovulate. So that's a good rule of thumb. A third thing, and something that a lot of people don't know, avoid using lubricants during sex when you're trying to conceive. Um, it turns out that these things can actually impede the mobility of sperm, which is not what we want. We want the sperm to be able to travel as fast as possible and reach its destination, and lubricants can really slow them down. So, put those away. Um, another tip I have is to stay put after you have sex, and I mean that literally. <laughs> um, lay in bed for about 15 minutes. There has been a study that showed um, for women who were going through artificial insemination, those who laid still for 15 minutes after um, their procedure were 50% more likely to conceive than those who didn't. Now, this study has not been replicated um, for conception by intercourse, but in my book, it can't hurt. I can say from my own experience, that was something we learned after several months of trying for our first, and we, we started doing that right away when trying for our second. We did get pregnant much faster with our second. I can't say if that's why, I'm just saying it didn't hurt. The next tip, and it's probably the hardest, is relax. It's really hard to relax when you're really trying to have a baby and you're getting stressed out and you really want you know, something to work out, but the truth is stress can really impede your chances of conceiving. So try to take deep breaths, have fun with the process, and try really hard not to worry. So those are some of my big tips on getting pregnant fast.